without a creative director. And if you ask me, they've done a fantastic job. But now, that is obviously going to change. For better or for worse, that is yet to be determined. It's the beginning of his career. He was always passionate about music and used to play in the band when he was in high school. When Pharrell was 12, he went to band camp and met someone who would have a big impact on his destiny, meeting Chad Hugo, with whom Pharrell would later establish the Neptunes. Hugo played the saxophone and he played the keyboard and drums. We met when we were like 12, started making music when we were like 15, 16. Um, we got discovered when we were in high school. Start off, I'm just gonna say that Pharrell has the potential to be a fantastic choice. And I'll explain why. During his tenure as creative director, Virgil challenged our traditional understandings of luxury fashion and streetwear. And because of how well that was received, it's something that I imagine Louis Vuitton wants the new creative director to continue doing. Well, in that respect, Pharrell makes sense. Tap by Pharrell Williams. If it were too uniform, it would be boring. Now the challenge is to get everyone aligned and to strike the right balance between modernity and tradition, past and future. Pharrell's unique style encourages a new group of creative people to be themselves and boldly follow their own ideas. 